I am feeling really stressed lately. You think it's because you drink so much caffeine? I don't even drink that much. You need to stop drinking so much caffeine. You're saying your anxiety's high. You're not feeling good. It's obviously the caffeine. Did you change your shirt? No, I didn't change my shirt. Clearly the caffeine is affecting your mind. Watermelon and white monster taste like heart go burr. Do you at least keep some aspirin in your car for when you finally do have a stroke? I change my socks before I drink it. So everything's going to be fine. You don't need to worry. You know, you're only supposed to get like, uh, like four or five cups of coffee maximum per day of caffeine. How many, uh, how many is that in monsters per day? Wow, Americans really will measure in anything but the metric system. That is wild. Look, you say it's gonna make me take the forever nap. I say it makes my heart go burr. Neither of those things seem like a bad thing to happen. So please, just leave me alone. Hey, you got the time? Um, yeah, it's 13.52. 13.52? What? Is that some kind of, what kind of, is that some kind of weird time? Roger, it's military time. My name's not Roger, it's Bill. Roger works in accounting. What are you talking about? Uh, Roger means like affirmative. Um, sorry. Are you okay, man? Negative. Okay, you, you're saying a bunch of numbers for the time. You're saying, ne are you, a, you're saying negative. Are you a robot? What's going on here? Am I being punked? I'm sorry. I'm broken. I, I, I'm trying my best. Okay, just talk like a normal human being. No, I got punished for that. They'd make us do push-ups and run. Who? Who Were you in some kind of cult? Really, it was more like a gang, but cult is kind of accurate too. How could it be similar to a gang and a cult? Well, it's like a cult because, you know, when you're in, you have a bunch of weird customs and stuff that you follow, but it's like a gang because when you get out, they, they won't stop calling you and then they come try and find you to get you to come back in. Guys, our annual office work trip is coming up. Uh, I need you all, guys all to be prepared. Office work trip? Okay, I'll prepare. Why did you just start drinking from that oddly large cup? I'm hydrating for the trip. Why do you need to hydrate? Because I have no idea what we're going to be doing and what if I pass out from dehydration? What do you think that we're going to be doing where dehydrating and passing out is even a possibility? This is a corporate work trip. Don't blame me when you fall out. What does falling out mean? Doc's going to hit you with a silver bullet if you go down. Hit me with what? The silver bullet. Is Doc like a werewolf hunter? What are you talking about? No, he sticks it in your bum to make sure your temperature is okay. I can't fire you because it's a tax write-off, but I need you to get out of my office um, right now. I'm not feeling good today. Well, you got two options. You can rip it or rip out. Rip it or rip out. What does that mean? Rip it means you're going to throw in an upper decky lip pillow and butt chug some caffeine. And rip out's going to require you to have a wobbly stool and six feet of rope. What, uh, what's an upper decky lip pillow? And what would I possibly need six feet of rope and a wobbly stool for? Honestly, I don't have, like, the wherewithal or the intestinal fortitude to explain all this stuff to you. Do you have four years um, to commit to the United States government in uniform? You don't want to take the time to explain these references to me, so instead you'd rather I commit four years of my life to the government. Yeah. Didn't you say you hated, like, most of it? Um, yeah, I mean, I hated some of the people. But you want me to do it. Yeah, I don't actually like you that much. Hey, man, what are you going to do when you get out of the military? I don't know, but whoever's hiring people that can sweep the sun off the sidewalk, I mean, I'm, I'm a shoe-in. I've got a lot of experience doing that. Sweep the sun off the sidewalk? What are you talking about? Yeah, or find the best rock. Yeah, I always found the best one. I was the, I was the best at that. What? What are you talking about? I mopped the rain off of 
the parking lot. There wasn't any left. God thought he had me. And it, I, I mopped every bit of that rain. There wasn't any. I was so fast. The rain couldn't fall fast enough. I mopped it. Is this... You went to that, like, uh, clinic for a couple days? Is Did they give you something? Did they do something to you? What What's going on right now? I carried around a plant. Carried around a plant for a while. Because they said I was stealing oxygen. And the plant was supposed to replace the oxygen I was stealing. Who made you do that and why? Why would they do that? Because I didn't wear the special hat outside. You didn't have a hat on outside and they made you do that? I can't not wear a hat now. I always have a hat. Don't go outside without a hat. Without a cover. The sun will get you. I got this new military grade thing I want to show you. Get it away from me! Oh my, what? what? What's wrong? Don't get it near me. If it's military grade, it's more likely to catch fire than anything else. No, no, it's like luggage for, for my trip. And it's kind of fun, you know, it's military grade, like, I could pretend like I was in the military with you. Okay, don't ever, ever repeat what you just said to anyone else or me again, okay, or I might die of cringe. You are really ornery, like, every day. Did you, did you drink coffee yet today? No, I'm trying to cut back. Okay, well, for mine and everyone else's sake, why don't you take some paid time off uh, and, and wean yourself off the caffeine? What, what is paid time off? It, it's like days off that you get, but you still get paid. Um, and you just take them. They, what? They just let you off? What, 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 what does the reason have to be? I mean, you don't really have to have a reason. You just get it. I don't understand. And I'm, I'm scared. We're getting paid double time over the holidays. Some other time! Ugh, what? Some other time? What are you talking about? No, it's this ho these holidays, not some other time. Sorry, it's just a, a force of habit. Okay, well, that's not even close to the most concerning thing you've ever said, but it's fine. The supervisor of the store is coming down today. They want us to lay out some of the items so that they can, like, inspect them and stuff. Uh, make sure we're, we're okay. They want to do a what? They just want, like, they just want us to, to grab a bunch of stuff. I uh, have a list. And they want us to put it on the f on the floor so they can just see it. Some of the uh, like electronics and and some of the equipment. I d I don't ha I didn't get issued anything. I don't have anything to lay out. No, I know all the things. We have all of them. They're over there. You said he's coming at three o'clock. Why is he Why is he even awake at three o'clock in the morning? Three o'clock p.m. P.m. What are you? Not in the morning. <laughs> I'm scared. Some of the other people that work here, they're, they're saying that you have like a really bad attitude and that you're kind of mean. Well, I explained to them, and now I'll also explain to you, that being direct is not having a bad attitude, and also I don't care about their opinions. Okay, but don't you think it would make for a better work environment if you were just a little bit more agreeable? Like, how do you sleep at night knowing all of your coworkers hate being around you? With the fan on. With the fan on. So you're just not open to the idea that maybe you should just be like a, a little bit nicer to people around here. Like you just don't care about anybody's opinion. I don't even care about my own mom's opinion. What do you, what do you think I care about any of yours? I cannot believe we hired you. Having just one person like you around makes everything significantly more difficult. Well, that's interesting because this quarter has been the best quarter this place has seen in the last 10 years. And guess what? What? They just hired three more veterans. What? And guess who recommended the names?